What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If it is the first time you're touching down on this channel, welcome to Small Feet, Big Heat. We talk sneakers, we talk streetwear, and everything in between. And today, we are definitely in the in-between. Today is going to be a really cool video. I went back and forth about whether or not I wanted to do it, but I decided, you know what? I definitely have to participate. Today, we are jumping into the Cactus Plant Flea Market and McDonald's collaboration. If you don't know who Cactus Plant Flea Market is, if you're not familiar with the name, they are responsible for some of my favorite favorite Nike collaborations. They're responsible for these sneakers right here. I know they're probably ugly to a lot of people. They're like, what? But these are some of my favorite sneakers. This is the Cactus Plant Flea Market and Nike Vapor Max. Actually, one of the first sneakers that I ever unboxed on this channel. So talk about a full circle moment. And they're also responsible for these right here. Easily one of my favorite Air Forces in the collection. The left shoe says Sunshine, and you can see those 3M hits that I definitely love on the shoe. This one says Air. It's kind of like an up-tempo vibe. I like these a lot. And they're also responsible for this shoe right here, which had a lot of people panicking when they first dropped. This is the Nike Blazer Mid Cactus Plant Flea Market collaboration. Some people, some haters call these clown shoes, but I get a lot of compliments on these whenever I wear them. People always ask, did they come like this? Are they, you know, two different pairs of shoes that I'm putting together? No, you had to customize the shoes on Nike by you. These were definitely a panic drop and I really wish that I would have picked up more than one pair. But we're not here to talk about sneakers today. No, no, no. We're getting into the Cactus Plant Flea Market and McDonald's collaboration, like I said. So this bag is getting a little cold. I think it, you know, hit my doorstep like 30 minutes ago from Uber Eats. In total, I spent, I wanna say $43 on this. Each Happy Meal or adult Happy Meal was about 15 bucks and change, which is crazy to me. Absolute madness. It's been a minute since I bought you know, a, a happy meal, definitely. But McDonald's in general, I don't really eat McDonald's. So it's been a couple of years since I had McDonald's. Y'all let me know if the, if the happy meals are like 15 bucks, that's wild. Or if the prices are just a little jacked up for this collaboration in particular. But you know what? It will probably be cheaper if you went into your local McDonald's. My local McDonald's, local McDonald's, is not very local at all. It's actually pretty deep. So I went ahead and I got it on Uber Eats. Let's go ahead and open this up. Like I said, I did get two of them. So there's one. Oh, this one got a little, this one got a little banged up, but it's all right. And here's two. These are definitely collectibles, and I'm a big, big fan of collectibles. Outside of sneakers, hats, clothing, I'm a big toy collector, designer toys, vintage toys, so on and so forth. So this was not, you know, a debate of whether or not I was gonna participate in getting them. It was just really how I wanted to get them. Obviously, you can go this route right here where you order a bunch of Happy Meals and you just keep going until you get all four of the collectible figures and the four collectible figures are actually seen on the box right there let it focus a bit so you can see so you'll get four of the collectibles the hamburglar grimace birdie and i forgot the last guy's name cactus buddy that's his name so you can keep buying happy meals you know take that route and kind of blind bag it or you can just go on eBay and pick up all four for about 50 to 80 bucks, depending on you know the seller that you decide to go with. Those are the price ranges that I'm seeing right now. And they do have a whole online store open right now on Cactus Plant Flea Market, where there's a bunch of merch, which I will not be participating in that, because like I said, yeah, the collaboration with McDonald's is cool, but I'm here for the collectibles. But I will say the plushies option, if you scroll all the way down on the Cactus Plant Flea Market and McDonald's webpage that's up right now on their website, you scroll all the way down. The plushies option, that's like 250 bucks where you get four jumbo plushies. That's insane. Like that, that's pretty cool. But anyways, let's take a closer look at this box. So you do have two options. You can get the Big Mac, or you can get 10 piece chicken nuggets. The box definitely gives me cactus plant flea market vibes. You know, the text with the backgrounds is definitely their aesthetic. I feel like it matches up perfectly with the McDonald's aesthetic. So it says limited edition McDonald's. 
We love to see you with a smiley face. You got the ba da ba ba ba. It's really nice. So yeah, these are gonna look great as display pieces. I'm definitely gonna try and be careful with them. It is raining in New York, so the boxes did get a little damp, but they'll dry off and they'll make some nice display pieces, like I said. Let's open this first one up. I had to go with the chicken nuggets option. It's been years, like I said, since I ate McDonald's and I feel like the safest way to go is the chicken nuggets. So I'm gonna have to heat these up. I'm not eating them cold. But there you go, the chicken nuggets. I did get two mediums. Here are the fries. You got the tangy barbecue because that is the only way to go. That is the best sauce. Oh, there's a loose nugget in here. Let me go ahead and put that in there. Guess that one escaped. And of course, what we all here for, the toy. So let's put that to the side. Here's box number two and it's basically the same you got the fries on that, tangy barbecue, like I said, chicken nuggies, and another one of the toys. So this bag is blue and this bag is green. Hopefully that means that I got two different toys. Now I know there was something about like certain orders might get a free t-shirt or a free hoodie thrown in. I guess I'm not one of the lucky ones. I don't have a t-shirt and a hoodie in my order. All right, for the moment y'all have all been waiting for, for the moment that I'm waiting for, let's go ahead and open these up. It definitely brings back nostalgia of buying a Happy Meal you know, wondering which toy that you got, being disappointed when you didn't get the one that you wanted. <laughs> and yeah, it's just, it's a vibe, you know? I, this collaboration was good. This was a good collaboration, good thinking on Cactus Plant Flea Market and McDonald's and bam, we got Grimace. So you can see it has the double eyes and that's kind of the Cactus Plant Flea Market signature. This is dope. This is gonna just make like a nice little thing to maybe sit in the back of the videos whenever I finish the setup or just sit in the room, you know, maybe set it up next to the sneakers or something. Very cool. Got the boy Grimace. All right, let's see what else we have. I have a feeling that this is going to be, what is it, Cactus Buddy? I just feel like that one is probably like the most common one. And from like the feel of it, it is Cactus Buddy. All right, so I was right about that one. So it seems like I need Hamburglar and Birdie to complete my set. But yeah, I'm very happy with these. It's a vibe. You know, I don't know about buying Happy Meals until you complete the set. I feel like that's kind of a hit or miss unless you got the plug at McDonald's who's willing to, you know, feel up on the bags and make sure that you get all four with your order. But definitely a dope idea. Y'all let me know what y'all think down below in the comment section of all of these uh, different McDonald's collaborations. I will say, and this might be a hot take, I like this collaboration way more than the Cactus Jack collaboration, way more. This, is act this actually feels nostalgic, more nostalgic, where the Cactus Jack release felt more hype beasty. Yeah, this does have a little bit of a hype beast element for sure, but I do feel like this is a little more along the lines of nostalgia and Cactus Jack felt very hype beasty. So y'all let me know what y'all think down below in the comment section. Again, we got Grimace and Cactus Buddy. I'll probably be going on eBay to complete the set. And if I do decide to pick up those plushies, y'all will definitely see them on the channel. Remember, if you enjoyed today's video, like, comment, subscribe, show a small YouTuber some love, and I will check y'all out in the next one.